Hey, um, last week I made a video about our tablet and a integrated Arduino board. And today I would like to share a real Arduino application, our track monitoring system. Um, in this product, the tablet I'm using is Q896. I can, you can copy the product link from the description below. Then let's talk about our applications here. I made a re really simple UI here, and uh, this is the CCTV camera view. I will connect the camera a bit later. And this is the temperature diagram, shows the data read from the heat sensor that you are about to see. And uh, here is the state displaying area. And at last, here is the data of the real reader. Um, but I didn't connect the real reader to the Arduino board this time. All right, let's talk about the um, heat sensor first. The heat sensor is designed to detect the temperature of the brick on the track. This one. And um, before we start to do the test, we need to do the setting first. Right here, there's an invisible button, and the password is set. Submit password, and right there is a three levels of temperature alarm. When the temperature is higher than 80 degrees, the background of the state displaying area will turn yellow. When it reaches to the level 2, which is higher than 110 degrees, the background will turn red. And when it's higher than 130 degree, the background will flash and there will be a sound alarm. So right now, let's do the test. So when the fire is on, the temperature goes really high. And when it's higher than 130, obviously it's making a long. Well, it's a bit too high here, but when it goes down, goes lower than 130, the sound will be off. But it's still in the warming state. and the background turns yellow it sh sh should go back to normal when it's lower than 80 great and right now i plug in the camera you can see me here and the camera we are using is actually the cctv camera and the reason why we are not using the usb camera is basically because of the distance so imagine if you put the product in a track and the real camera will obviously longer than five meters and the five meters is the limit for the USB camera. So you basically need a analog camera for the tablet, which is not really common stuff. So what we did is uh, we connect the CCTV camera directly into the tablet. So um, in order to receive the view for the tablet, you need a library, which is provided by the processor factory. And um, with the library, the coding is really simple. Several lines will display the view of the camera. And if you click the view, it will go full screen. Yeah, so basically that's all about the track application. So if you like our product or you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or contact me by the email, which is on the description below. And um, see you next time.